Hello, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. When is the best time to hear from God? Isaiah 54, 5 says, He wakes me morning by morning, wakens my ear to listen like one being instructed. The Sovereign Lord has opened my ears. For everything, there is a time and a season. Psalm 19, 2 says, Day after day, they pour forth speech. Night after night, they reveal knowledge. In the old days, we had broadcast networks with precise schedules for all their programmes. If the prime news hour was 6am each day and you tuned in at 7am, you could no longer catch the news. You have missed it for that day. And all you can do is settle for second-hand information, which is not the same as you hearing the news yourself. So also hearing from God has its own time and season. And if you know when he attends to people, you can take full advantage of that. Jesus understood this principle. He woke up early to get his father's attention. Those who waken up to catch the news from God go forth to make news on earth. His speech drops upon his people at the dew and dew falls in the early hours of the morning. You can't be a heavy sleeper and also expect to be a star at the same time. You have to choose one. You are either a sleeper or you are a star. Nothing corrupts your destiny like sleep. Sleep kills destinies and dreams. It frustrates men and destroys them spiritually. Numerous examples prove we have to wake up early to seek God. For example, Abraham, the father of faith. Genesis 19.27 says, Abraham got up early in the morning to the place where he stood before the Lord. Exodus 34.4 And he hewed two tables of stone like unto the first, and Moses rose up early in the morning and went up unto Mount Sinai. Moses woke up early to keep an appointment with his God, and the Lord descended to meet him there. Will you? Will you keep an appointment with God? We also have the example, strong and courageous Joshua. And Joshua rose early in the morning and the priests took up the ark of the Lord. Joshua 6, 12, 15 says, And it came to pass on the seventh day that they rose early about the dawning of the day. They rose up so early and compassed the obstacles about and they gave way. If you are very observant, you will discover that most instructions you have received from the Lord came in the wee hours of the morning. Every time you are at a crossroads, just get up early and meet him and worship him. And in the midst of that, you will hear his instructions.